Okay, at Lowe's, we bought these plastic toggles for a hollow door, they're anchors. Uh, we have a hook that Kevin, when he redid our little bathroom, he had put it up temporarily, and now we need to go ahead and put these door anchors in. Um, at Walgreens, we bought two Blue Monday candy bars. We bought a mint and just a regular, and we bought two packages of candy corn M&Ms and a Nerds Rope. We don't know if this is a different flavor. We've tried the blue and the red. This says it's spooky nerds. It might be a different um, flavor, for, flavor for Halloween, I don't know. And then we bought two of these um, uh, zombie food. It's milk chocolate covered assortment of brain's feet and hearts filled with ooey red caramel. So we'll be trying that. And then we bought 18 of the Russell Stover caramel brownie. Have to keep those in stock. And two of the uh, two packages of just regular candy corn, and I bought four of the full size uh, Hershey's candy corn candy bars. These are amazing. They they did just have the minis, and this year they actually came out with the full size. I guess they saw that they were really popular. And then at Kroger we bought two um, Diet A and Ws and three uh, Diet Seven Ups and five uh, Diet Cokes. I ran out to Walgreens and got 2% milk, eggs, and a Funfetti cake mix. Um, normally I don't get the Funfetti kind, but they didn't have any like plain white ones, so I went ahead and got the Funfetti. And I'm gonna make the frosting, so. At Target, I got a box of Cheerios, and they had a really small box that was $2.54. This was $2.50 for the big box, so I went in and got that. Um, I got these Scent Renewits things. I love these. I use them all the time. Um, sea salt chocolate candy corn. Some peppers to make with chicken. And then a couple weeks ago, I got some gray dress pants that I love, love, love. And so I got some more in different colors. Okay, Kevin went to a couple of places after work today. One of them was Walgreens, and he bought a ton. I can't even tell you how many. Um, he bought caramel and caramel brownie and sea salt caramel. So, lots and lots of caramel. One thing about these caramels that he loves is you get a lot of caramel. When you bite into it, it's very, very thick. So, anyway, he bought those at Walgreens. He also bought the Starburst, the Halloween mix. I had seen them and thought that they were the same flavors, but I think they're actually different flavors. So we're going to be trying those. And then he went to Meyer. Now we hadn't been in Meyer in a while, and I kind of feel bad because somebody had asked me to send them some of these, and I've already mailed the box off. So if you're watching this, I'm sorry I didn't send you these. I did send her something else she wanted though, so so it'll be okay. But I we. Meyer is the only place around here where you can find these bars and we just hadn't been and I wanted to get her box off to her So anyway, we bought he bought three of the Lucky Charms and he bought five of the Reese's Puffs and you cannot find those anywhere around here but Meyer either and then he bought uh, Brock's Milk Made Caramel Lovers and Keebler Chips Deluxe, the peanut butter with M&M's. They're new. We had not seen these at our Walmart. And then he bought the Brock's gummies, candy corn gummies. I don't know if these are new this year or not. And these are Brock's caramel, apple caramel royals. And then he bought Tootsie caramel apple pops. These are uh, suckers. And they have green apple, golden delicious, and red Macintosh flavors. And then he bought two boxes of Cheez-Its because they were on sale. A box of Colby and the Italian four cheese. He loves those. And then he's really enjoying taking these Nutter Butters to work as part of his lunch. So that is um, Kevin's uh, Walgreens and Meyer haul. From Target, we bought two of the Caramel Apple Oreos. These are limited edition, and I'm almost positive they're Target exclusive. And then we found the Fiber One uh, Pumpkin Bars, finally, to try. And we also spotted these uh, elsewhere, so I think our whole area got them at the same time. 
And then uh, these are absolutely wonderful. Um, they're charms, candy corn pops. They're just suckers. But they are the best tasting candy corn suckers that Kevin and I have ever had. So they're wonderful. And then we're going to try these um, for a video. These uh, are candy corn and these are pumpkin pie. And they're truffles. You get eight truffles in each box. And then Kevin bought a sign for his office. On one side it says, caution zombies ahead. And then it has the, which, uh, people, which one are you going to show? This one? That one. So this will be behind him. Might, his, put, it, might put it behind me or just uh, put it in the door. Hopefully this will be like behind him on his yeah. lunchtime review. That would be cool. And then at Kroger, I got the... Limited edition pumpkin pie toaster strudels. They only come around once a year. They had, last year though, right? they had them last year, right? But they only have them once a year, so it's worth going ahead and getting them. And then somebody recommended this to Kevin the um, Healthy Choice uh, Meatball Marinara. And we got some Kraft cheese and some Lloyd's uh, pork. And then we bought buns to go with the pork. You know, you could save a dollar on something. If you buy two of them. Oh, okay. And then we bought bread and oranges and my uh creamy laughing cow cheese was on sale so i bought three and then this was the free friday today these trolley things and they had the uh the little balls but we've tried those and we've never tried these sharks so i want to try the sharks and then we found the limited edition twinkies these are pumpkin spice and we bought an 18 pack of eggs at Walgreens, we've just bought six of these Twizzlers. Now, we did see packages of, um, like, they were bigger at Target. They had, king like, size. well, yeah, they were king size, so they probably had eight of these in there. But I truly like buying them portioned, only 190 calories, so that's why I buy them at Walgreens. The rest of the stuff is from Walmart. I bought a can of tuna in water, a bag of peanut M&M's, a bag of this grilled and ready uh, fajita chicken breast strips. If you've never heard me talk about this stuff, I love it because you can eat this entire bag for only 200 calories. So um, I'm going to have that for dinner one night. And then these are new. These are Doritos loaded and these are nacho cheese and then they have jalapeno and cheese. So Kevin and I will be trying those. They look really good. Bought more of these Smuckers Uncrustables. These are with the um, hazelnut for Ashley. I bought more of these uh, Grand Slams. Now, Kevin and I did a video on these, and I thought I liked the grape the best. But after um, eating a lot of two them, boxes. after going through two boxes, I like the strawberry the best. So that's weird for me, but true. We bought more crispy chicken strips. And then Kevin bought this uh, pulled pork. They had, what are the... They had that roasted pork. They had what? Pulled pork and pulled. They had roasted beef too. Roasted beef, and you wanted the roasted pork. The pork is lower calories. Okay. Not and that then, I, you should look at the calories when you're looking at them. Right. The barbecue. And then I had, I only needed snack bags, but I had a coupon. You saved a dollar if you bought two, and we're going to use the storage bags anyway, so I went ahead and bought those. And then let this, let me tell you about this tide just real quick. This Tide is the Febreze Spring and Renewal. If you smell it in the store, if you take the cap off, I did not like the smell of it at all when I opened the cap. I thought, oh no, I've made a mistake. But then I was stuck with it at home. So I used it and after actually using it and going through the washing process and the dryer, your clothes actually smell really, really fantastic. So don't judge that on first impression in the store I actually take it home and let your clothes go through it and it, it really smells good anyway i've been impressed with it so then we bought a package of eight sparkle paper towels and that one of my hand soap things was messed up it, one squirts out, it was squirts you in the belly. it was like squirting across the yeah right up to your um your blue jeans so i bought a new con um container um what do I want to say? Square container of hand A new container of hand sanitizer and a new um, refill. Uh, refill. <laughs> I will find my words. And then we bought a stud finder because Kevin had one that went bad. And then these are actually for Andrew. We bought them, so I'm showing them to you, but they're for Andrew's closet. He needs them in his closet. And we're going to try to find a stud in Andrew's closet. Okay, I just have a few more things to show you. At Target, we actually bought a new set of sheets. 
These are from the uh, uh, Shabby Chic collection, and I just love the print on these. They reminded me uh, of something that my grandmother Scott used to have, so I love them. They were $52, so they weren't cheap. Granny sheets. Uh, but Kevin likes them too. They're granny sheets, but they're nice. <laughs> And then we bought this three and a half pound bag of Smarties because Kevin likes Smarties. Well, they're low calorie. They're only 25 calories per thing. Right. So Kevin really likes those. Then we bought these exclusive flavor Pringles. White cheddar and black pepper and bourbon barbecue chicken. Those are both exclusive to Target. And then I haven't had these in a long time. These Boom Chicka Bites. I bought the sweet and salty nut and the... Um, mixed berry my favorite bag of these is the green bag i don't remember what flavor it was i just remember it was my favorite and they i can't find it anywhere at cvs we bought these brookside bought fruit and nut bars this is the dark chocolate um let's see what do they have in them this is blueberry and this is cherry and this is cranberry and then at Walgreens, we bought the Elizabeth Hasselbecks. I think they're called Noji. Look like Noogie. Noogie? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Um, I know she has to have a gluten-free diet, so I, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. But this one's called Nuts About Nuts, and this is the peanut butter and chocolate bar. And then somebody asked me to try these. These are the only place I have seen these is Whole Foods. So we went to Whole Foods today. It's they're called Hi, I'm Skinny Sticks. And I think Ashna wants me to review these. She said she loves the sweet potato, but then they also have the um, ancient grain sea salt. So I figured I would get that too. So that is it.